What's up guys, it's X2Robby2X here, and I am back with some Minecraft getting technical. And I, uh, I don't know, I tried recording right, right after the last episode, you saw I got a lot of lag, and I tried recording, but I don't know, it just would not do, and I just kept lagging, so I guess, oh, you guys have seen the surprise. So yeah, while I was trying to recording and while I was lagging, I actually wandered out in that direction over there, towards the desert, and oh, oh you saw the second surprise but towards that direction towards the desert and I found there's like a little grass clearing over there and I found some wolves over there um, three wolves to be particularly oh, anywhere here no but then also look look at this I don't know if you guys can see this I don't know if you guys can like picture this but that's that does that not look like a cat and that sort of like another cat or a little puppy dog like you see like there's there's the cat's ears, here's his face, here's his little mouth. You, you can see some whiskers or some kind of a line here and you know like hair and it just looks <laughs> I don't know, but it just looks like a cat. And then here, I mean, here's a dog's nose, mouth, his ears, head, body. It's just I don't know. I thought this was like the coolest thing when I uh <laughs> when I got here. So, that's <laughs> that's a surprise. But the other surprise is, oh hell, hello pigs. The other surprise is dogs or wolves. And wolves are actually important because when you feed them, they drop dung. I don't know if there's any around, but I have some in a chest. Seven dung. Yes, it's, it's poop. Okay, so that one I ate it. That one. Eat it. All right, that one I ate it. That one's not hungry. When you feed them, they produce poop, or dung, and that is actually used to create well, tanned leather. Now, tanned leather, first we have to get scoured leather, and what that means... What? Really? Okay, some stupid endermen. Wow. Stupid endermen are stupid. I don't know where these are coming from, but I guess on our way to the... To really? Two blocks? Oh, well, I guess you only placed one. Uh, I'm gonna have to check around to see which. Let's, let's just check to see which cactus is missing, because that's kind of stupid, and I don't want dangerous things coming in here. But whatever, we'll fix that later. So we're gonna need some leather, and we're gonna need to create some scoured leather out of that. And what that means, pretty much, you take um, you take the leather and get all the hair and blood off of it. Apparently, well, that's what it says on the Better Than Wolves website. So I'm going to go ahead and take their word for it. Oh, little leg again. I'm not liking this. It's just something. I don't know what. So let's get all the hemp out of here. And let's get half of the leather in there. And then half of the leather in there. Go ahead and press that button. And we're going to be expecting leather over in our pickup spot eventually. So while that's that's going on, we have a bunch of whoa leg again. Uh, so we have a bunch of hard boiled eggs, which is awesome. And they produce I mean they provide awesome health. And then for the you know in the next I mean last episode, I was asking you guys if you you know any way of getting items up. Well I thought of something. It's like an elevator ooh well, hello, how much did I get? Oh, 18 eggs, not bad. We got some rope. But I thought of some kind of an elevator that um, pushes items up. And how I actually did this in creative mode, so I know it works. But we might have to dig a lot of this up, and it's going to look probably really bad. But what it's going to do is pretty much like if there's an item, like let's say there's an item right here, there will be a piston under it, it will push it up, and there will be a piston right here, They'll push it to the side, and there'll be another piston right here. Push it up, push it to the side, push it up, push it to the side. So we kind of make a staircase of pistons going from under there up here. So here I'll just push a button, and it would just propel all the items up to me. So once we get enough redstone and iron, um, we may have enough. I don't know. I'm going to need... Oh, wait. What is this? Um, This is Y equals 65. And this is... Y equals 53. So we're going to need, if it's 12 floors and it's 2 pistons per floor, we're going to need 
24 pistons. So that's a lot, but we're also going to need a lot of repeaters. Did I get any leather yet? Nope. We're going to need a lot of repeaters. And what else? I don't know. And like a lot of redstone. And that's pretty much it. And is there any leather coming down yet? I need some. Oh, there we go. We see some scoured leather. Sweet. Oh, that's not what I want to do. I want to eat this one. And now what what you eh, what we have to do with the scoured leather is we have to put the scoured leather in the cooking pot or um this I don't know what it's called, the stewing pot with some dung and it's going to give us tanned leather. So let's actually try this out. Let's get all the eggs out of there. Put some dung and some scarred leather in there. There we go. And that's going to give us, um, yeah, that's going to give us leather. Come on, give us some leather. What? Oh, oh, no, no. Ah, uh, what just happened? I did, I was not reading about this at all. So apparently, if you cook dung in <laughs> the stewing pot and you leave any other food in there, it's gonna give you foul food. That makes sense. All right, so now it gives. Ah, that sucks. I guess I'm gonna have to create a new. Well, oh well. Wow, that's a lot of foul food. I should have just thrown it in the fire. So we're going to get some more tanned leather, I believe, hope. Alright, so we have that, let's, I'm just going to let the eggs cook. Let's see if all the leather's gone. Right. Every time I get around this area and around the stewing pot, I just, it just starts lagging. I don't know why. So let's put the hemp back in there. I'm not going to do anything with that right now. Yeah, every time I get around that and around here, it's kind of lag, but now it's not lagging anymore, so that's... I guess that's good. What we're going to need is... Um, I don't know why I just opened this up. What did... I, I forgot what I'm doing. Oh yeah, tanned leather. Oh, nope, I'm going to have to go pick up the scoured leather from underneath. Because there was a lot of it down there, so... I hope I don't miss any of it. Yep, we have 14. That's all the leather that we need. Sweet. For now, I'm just going to put the leather in here. And put the rest of the eggs in the cooking pot. Because all my food just went foul. So that's awesome. That's really, really awesome. And... Okay, we have two tanned leather. So what we can do with this is actually create a belt. We have, we make straps, and we have 16 straps, and then if we put our straps like this, we can create a belt. Now, let me see what else do we, I need some iron. I need exactly three iron. One, two, three. And what we can do with iron is... Yeah, I have the I have the website right on another screen, so that's where I'm reading it from. We're gonna need three gears, and what else do we need? Three gears, a belt, and two wooden planks. So what we can do with that is put the gears like this, a belt in the middle, and iron ingot across, and we get ourselves a saw. So. What do we do with the saw? Um, we're gonna need to. Hmm. Wait. Let me. Let me go to the other page. How do we create it? Okay, an axle. We're gonna need some wooden planks. And because we're gonna need to split that power. So wooden planks. Thanks for those eggs. And some rope. I think seven should be enough. So like this. Like this. Got some some axles. That's a lot of eggs. I'm liking this egg farm. It's really producing, and this like that's great because this mod actually makes eggs really really useful. And I'm not even in I'm not even in demand for watermelon. I don't think I'm gonna start a watermelon farm 
just because it's it's really unnecessary. So, okay, so we have ourselves a saw. We have some axles, and let's go ahead and get these gear boxes out of here. And I should probably make one more. Okay, I need some sticks. I need one cobblestone. So let me. I hope I have some in this chest. Uh, yep, we have some cobblestone. Just in case we need to create a lever to shut off the saw, we'll know where it is. So, wait, let me let me check. Let me check back again. Mm, how do you create a? Ooh, all right. So with the saw, we actually have the opportunity to create a water wheel, which is another source of power, just like the wow, just like the windmill. And then let's see. Oh whoa whoa hey how'd you how'd you jump over? What? How how did that happen? Alright, that was kinda crazy. Nope, that's no 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 no. That's not what I wanted to do. Let me get some of planks. And like this. Get out of here. Alright. So the saw, I think, can only be powered from the side. So, if we put the saw right... Huh. So let's, let's get some power out of here. Because I only have two gearboxes. I forgot that I, sh I probably should have made more. So, like this. Uh, there we go. Is that... I can't see. Is that attached on the other side? Whoa. No, no. There we go. Okay, so it's attached on the other side. And uh huh. Alright, I got it, I got it. I know what I'm gonna do with this. It's one, two, three, alright, that's great. So like this. Like this. And we're gonna hook up the saw right here. Like this. And now this is really, really sharp. So we do not want to get close to this. But this is what we can do with it. Let's turn the power on. I hope we can. Okay, that's great. That's working. But see, you see the saw is smoking? That means it's working. Now, what the saw does is when you put planks in front of it, it can cut them up into little sidings. Now, what the siding does is you can literally place the siding like slabs and you can also place it vertically, horizontally like this. And so that's probably what we're going to actually make the saw out of right now. Because it's kind of dangerous to be near the saw so you have to have some kind of little protection. But the planks are just too thick to be putting in front of the saw. So I hope this should work and won't the saw won't cut me because you can actually use the saw to hurt entities. There you go. All right, so it doesn't cut me. So let's cut some more stuff down. You can actually when uh you get some. Huh? Where is that? Oh yeah, when you cut regular wood like normal wood you cut from a tree into planks, it gives you four planks plus it gives you um what does it give you like dust or something like that on a sawdust I believe and you can use that sawdust for other things that I haven't figured out yet but yeah so you can when you have the siding you cut that down into smaller pieces that's called molding and that's I mean that's that's like one half of the siding and you can keep cutting this down into little little pieces of corner and in the corner you can make other stuff which is really really cool and you can make some really cool decorative stuff so that's that. We have we have ourselves a saw. Probably, you know what? I don't know. Uh huh. I don't know why I'm making so much siding. I don't. I have no clue why I'm doing this. But let me check the other page again. What can we make with the saw? Hmm. Ooh, this is a good one. Oh, and a hopper. Alright. 
we're gonna get to that in the next episode, but I'm gonna figure out how to get glue because we need glue to all right, whatever. I'll, I won't tell you guys. <laughs> so if we go ahead and make ourselves a crafting table, so let's see, we we'll put a crafting table. I don't know. So let's put it. What if we just put it down here or just like right? Here? No, that's not gonna work. That's where you gotta put the items. If we just put the put a stone right here so we know where to put the items. Oh, no, 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 why, why did I just did, why did you do that? Ah, oh, come on. I forgot, if you put anything that the saw can't cut in front of it, it breaks the saw. So, oh, we only got two iron ingots back. Wait, does it only take two iron ingots? No, it takes three iron ingots. That's great. I just broke the saw. But, I'm going to replace the saw in a second, as soon as I show you what you can make with the decorative pieces. Okay, so with the decorative pieces, when you put two pieces of molding, like this, you get, I mean, yeah, you can combine the moldings back in the sidings and the sidings back in the planks. But when you put two pieces of molding like this and three siding up top, you get yourself a table. Now, this table is, I guess, like the table inside of these villages, I mean, the houses. But it does not, it, it's not a two-parter. I mean, it's not, let me turn that off real quick. I gotta get another saw. But it's not a two-parter, so um, I'm actually going to show you. Oh, whoopsies. I'm actually going to show you. Okay, they don't have a table in here, but nobody lives here. I want to hmm. Want to find a... Do you have a table in here? Nope. Table in here? Nope. Oh, well, I need to go down anyways, because a lot of hemp was just converted in the rope string, or whatever it was. See, there we go. Oh, I don't even have enough. Let me put some eggs in there. and I, I messed up my whole saw. Wait, did it? Alright, we still have the belt. We don't have to create another belt. But, I'm still looking for that, uh, that table. Basically, what a table is, it's a fence. Oh, right here. Basically, this is what the table looks like. It's a fence. I mean, it's a pressure plate on top of a fence. This table acts as one block. There's no, no necessary two blocks. And, you know, it's just it's just a cooler looking table because it actually, like, it looks more like a table. So, yeah, you can use that for decorative purposes. Like, you know, if I wanted a table right here, I got me a table. And, uh, now it's a... Oh, you can't put... Aww. You can't put torches on it. Oh, well. Well, I have a I have a nightstand, okay? If I if my bed was a little closer. Let me get back to the saw recipe. I gotta I gotta find this. All right. We need another ingot because that one broke. We need a belt. Three of those and two wooden planks. Okay, so we need another wheel. Or gear. Uh, oh, perfect. We have one more. We need another gear. So we got that going three iron up top two wooden planks on the bottom and we got ourselves another saw I'm gonna go ahead and connect this right now and I'm gonna oh actually I'm gonna show you the sawdust before we get out of here so I got me that the table can go in here I put all my wooden made stuff in here there we go so this kind of the siding kind of eliminates the use for a slab simply because you can just you know you can just have siding Whoa. all right so let's connect the saw back there we go right, let's turn it on eventually you know I'm gonna make I'm gonna make all the wiring underground and I'm gonna have T flip flops that open it so I can just that like turn it on so I can just oh ooh that's cool Wow, I did not know that you can do this. All right, let's let's rearrange this then, like this. <laughs> this is looking cool. What if we did it like this? Wow, oh, that is I don't know. This is looking <laughs> that looks a lot cooler. That's nice. So when you put down normal wood, it gives you four planks. Plus, it gives... Okay. We can't have this like that. No. Because then I can't get the, the stuff right next to the saw. So yeah, alright. Now that looks kind of goofy. 
Well, I just wanted to show you guys that you get four sawdust. You get two sawdust for every wood you break down. It just gives you planks, so. And I've heard, I haven't seen this yet, I haven't tested it out, that later on you can ac access a tree, there's a new type of tree added. You can access it and it allows you to make automatic wood farms using saws on those trees. I don't know how that works, but that sounds really cool. And yeah, so we made a saw this episode. I gotta go collect more hemp string. We, we made a table, I showed you some other cool stuff like sidings and whatnot. We made some foul food, which is not a great idea. I'm lagging again. I don't know what sawdust does, but I'm not going to put it in there. Might spoil all my food. And yeah, so, hope you enjoyed this episode. I have no clue how long this is. I forgot when I started recording. And I'm sorry for not recording uh, for the past, well, I haven't put out anything for the past two days. I've actually been working a lot on the mod. If you haven't seen it, it's on Minecraft WB's channel. I actually haven't been recording anything for the past week. All that you saw last week, I had recorded last weekend. So, yeah, sorry for that. I'm going to record a bunch today. And, yeah, I've just been working on the mod. And yesterday, I was on that 19-hour live stream. And I wanted to record some afterwards, but I was just passed out. There was no way I was going to record anything. I fell asleep at, like, 10 o'clock, which is not like me. But, yeah, sorry for talking your ears off, I guess. But... Thanks for watching, and see ya!